The hour is late. Please return tomorrow. There's no time! Beastmen have already invaded Jad and Astoria. They're on their way! Plus, I get stuck with this... fairy here! What? Oh, no! You must report to his eminence at once! Accept the goddess of manners blessings. You're the priest of light, right? Tell me how to change my class. I need to be stronger now. Please. Impossible. There is no way you could switch classes right now. You lack the experience necessary for such a feat. What? But I... You must have at least heard tell of the Mana Stones, correct? First, you must gain enough experience through battle, then call upon a Mana Stone's power to switch to another class. Who's got time for that? Your Eminence, if I don't get stronger, I can't give that crimson jerk what's coming to him! So, you're the Priest of Light, hmm? You're... Plainer than I expected. I was hoping you might have some wisdom to share. Whoa. Wait! I have something to say. Your Eminence, please listen. I have come from the Sanctuary of Mana to tell you that the Mana Tree is withering. Mana power grows weaker by the day. Withering? But without the mana tree, the seals on the mana stones will break. The Benevidons will be released into the world. The Benevid... what? What's that? You're acting like this doesn't affect you. You've been chosen by fairy. This means that you alone can retrieve the sword of mana from the sanctuary. I've been... what? She didn't mention that. Hey, hey, Fairy, what gives? I'm sorry. With the mana in the world so depleted, a fairy can't leave the sanctuary for long without a host. If I hadn't found you, he wouldn't have made it. Yeah, okay. That's good for you and all, but no thanks. I don't need the stress in my life. Go. Hunt that old man instead. Would that I were able to bear your burden. However, once a fairy finds a host, they are bound to them for their whole life. Only death can part them. Wait one second. I never agreed to this. I don't need a sword of mana or whatever. You want to defeat the Crimson Wizard, correct? With the Sword of Mana, you'll be the strongest swordsman in all the world! Hey, stop sneaking around in my mind! But, uh... <clears throat> what is the Sword of Mana anyway? The Sword of Mana is the embodiment of the ancient power of mana, guiding force of spirit. It is an alternate form of the Golden Wand used to create the world itself. The one who holds the Mana Sword gains awesome power. The sword lies in the roots of the Mana Tree, waiting. Before the Mana Tree withers completely, must reclaim the sword and awaken the goddess of mana once more. She alone can bring peace to the realm and grant your wish. 
So, if I get that sword, I can defeat the Crimson Wizard. Where can I find the Sanctuary of Mana? And how do I get there? I am so sorry. But with mana so depleted, I don't have enough power to open the portal to the Sanctuary. Not by myself. Throughout the world are eight points of mana energy. Mana stones. Sealing away the fearsome Benevidons. If you activate the mana stones, the portal connecting our world to the Sanctuary of Mana should appear. Through that portal is the Sanctuary. However, you should know that the energy inside the eight mana stones was sealed on purpose as the mana goddess began her slumber. So, what should I do? In ages past, there once was an ancient spell used to control the energy from the mana stones and bend it to the user's will. However, countries refused to allow each other any control of the spell and use of the mana stones. The war that followed caused unspeakable damage. It was nearly as destructive as the sealed Benevidons. The survivors cursed the magic to avoid future tragedy and forbade anyone from using it. Now the life of any person who uses the spell will be forfeit. There is no longer anyone alive who knows how to work this cursed spell. I guess that's it. There may be one way. If we borrow the powers of the elemental spirits that reside near the mana stones instead, I can combine their powers with what remains of mine to open the portal for everyone. Splendid! This is a relief. If you wish to find a mana stone, I've heard many say that the Lightstone is in Cascade Cavern, guarded by the elemental Lumina. It is the cavern you pass through in order to reach here. Take Fairy. With what remains of her power, she can help you find Lumina in the cavern. See if you may borrow his light powers. So, wait. The Sword of Mana? Huh. I think my mother mentioned that thing. But if I can get it before her, I can show her that I'm not powerless. She might even let me come back. Hey, take me with you. Please, come on. Certainly. And the more elementals we meet, the more magic you can learn yourself. Really? That's perfect. What you were talking to Grandpa about. You are no simple adventurer. 
since you have a quest of your own, I have a favor to ask. I gotta find Heath, and I need your help. Uh-uh, no can do. It's pretty dangerous where I'm headed. I can't take a little kid with me on such a long trip. Go back to your grandpa, okay? Don't worry. We'll find out what happened to Heath for you. He's gotta be out there somewhere. Just won't wait about Heath. Please. I really can't come with you. Oh, fine. You are so stubborn. And mean. You, you, you meanie. Gotta be the whole fairy was talking about, right? How are we supposed to get over there. Oh, right. I forgot you can't fly. I think I can use the residual mana power in the waterfall to get you over there. Hmm. Let's give it a try. swordsman in the world. to learn. 
what? we're looking for. It's a giant monster. So why do I feel mana power coming off? plight while you were fighting. Telepathy's great, huh? Just like Barry, we elementals need mana to live. I'll help however I can to make sure we save the mana of the world. Luna, where is the light stone? It's straight up from here, deep within the old ruins. But you can't exactly get there from here. Oh, no, 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 no. It's safe, though. For now, at least. It's so unstable. It seems like the Benevidon could be unsealed at any minute. We gotta get the rest of the elementals on board and open the portal to the sanctuary! Huh? Huh? Oh, looks like part of the cave broke in the fight. I think there's a shortcut. out all the enemies nearby. Thanks for taking down the cavern barrier. Saved us some trouble. <laughs> now, nothing's stopping us from invading Wendell. This is a present to show our appreciation. No! <laughs> Let's get going.
tree continues to wither. A hero must be found to take the Sword of Mana and awaken our goddess. Then, let us ask the Priest of Light for guidance. We must not delay any longer. Let's go! I cannot continue. What do you mean? We're so close! We can do this! Uh, I can't make it to the other realm with my powers. I'll leave the rest of it to you. Please, hurry. Oh, we cannot continue either. Please go on without us. Find our hero and save the mana tree. Uh, wait. Where? Uh, curses! What is this? Let me out now! Shh! Quiet! Someone there? Who are you? Where are we? Kevin. That's me. This is Jad. Prisons. Beastmen grabbed you all at the waterfall. Took you to these cells to keep you out of their way when you woke up. Wait. I can get us out. Don't worry. I know what to do. Leave the guard to me. Quit your yakking. Keep quiet. Ready. You okay? Uh, I'm sorry, Kevin, but I can't let you out. Luger's orders, you know? Ah, throwing the future king of Ferolia in prison, hmm? Huh? King finds out. Uh, hey, uh, wait a minute. I had orders. <sighs> Fine. Ludger's been acting kind of weird lately. I mean, it's, it's probably all a big misunderstanding anyway, right? <laughs> you can leave. Just be sure to put in a good word with the king, okay? Huh? Wait, no! You tricked me. Uh, sorry, Ferretti. Open now. Come out. Okay. Hurry to docks. There should be a, a boat. Let's leave the town. Beastmen are attacking Wendell, so fewer soldiers. We can catch the boat before it sets sail. Heard the townsfolk talk about it before I got caught. Hurry. Pray at the statue to heal. Looks like you need it. Go! Quick!
weekend. Don't keep me waiting. <laughs> you win. All right. Hurry. <laughs> Wasted too much time. We have to get to Maya and find the rest of the elementals. Huh? Oh. What? Don't worry. This is Fairy. She's from the Sanctuary of Mana. It's a long story, but she's sort of haunting me while we look for the Mana Stones and the elementals that protect them. Huh? Oh! A Priest of Light mentioned you. I uh, traveled to ask him for help. I heard about a person chosen by fairy. You. You must have a story too, right? Some reason to make this journey? So still. Yeah. Started with Carl. Persecuted by humankind, beastmen were forced to live a life of seclusion in the dark woods of Duskmoon Forest. Only one managed to stand up against the oppression. He became king. Under his rule, the beastmen banded together and created the kingdom of Ferolia. There, he and his kin waited for a chance to get revenge on the humans who drove them into hiding. <laughs> well, 
well, well, if it isn't his furry majesty himself. How do you do this fine, fine night? <sighs> Finally, the time is upon us, sire. With the coming shift of the world's mana power, now's the perfect opportunity for what? For us all to get back at those nasty humans. <laughs> Do I know you? Oh, how silly of me. They call me Gormont, Death Devourer. Our goals are the same, for I hate humankind as much as you do. I offer you some unsolicited help. Tch. Outsiders and help are unwelcome. Be gone! <laughs> no, 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 wait, wait, wait. I'll leave, but if you change your mind, my dark spell are always at your service. <laughs> Wait. I'll give you one chance. Oh, I shan't waste it. Now then, tell me what you would have me do and consider it done. Your majesty. <laughs> Kevin was the one and only son of Ferolia's king. The young boy's human mother had long since abandoned her half-blood child, leaving him to be raised in the forest by the Beastmen. Due to his Spartan upbringing, Kevin never connected with others. He was raised as his father's successor and trained to fight from infancy, leaving little time for friendships. One night, the young prince came across a slain mother wolf and her living pup, Carl. Finding a true friend in the affectionate wolf, the boy's frozen heart began to thaw. <laughs> hey, sleep good? Huh? Carl? What's that yip, Carl? Tiny, but still a wolf. Don't bark like a dog. Here, howl, like this. Huh. We're alike, you and me. A little wolf who acts like a dog. A beast man with human blood in my veins. And. Neither of us have a mom. Don't worry. Carl, got you. And I'll protect you, since your mom can't now. Carl, what's wrong? No, Carl. Can't fight you. Won't fight you. Stop. What are you doing? Carl! He's moving. Oh. 
on its own. No! 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 Carl! Carl! How did this happen? Unable to resist his beast man instincts, the boy transformed and attacked his only friend. Kevin made a grave by the flower patch they'd often visited. Racked with guilt, there he wept for his lost friend. So... So sorry, Carl. I'm sorry. Afterwards, Kevin didn't know how long he wandered the forest. Eventually, however, he made it back to the palace. But nothing was the same. Carl... ...couldn't protect my friend. I couldn't... ...stop... ...myself. Beast man blood... ...awakened. Why did I transform? Why? Why now? King might know something. By order of the king, the Beastmen forces are hereby sent out to take over human settlements. Our first target is the holy city, Wendell. Yes, sir. Now's our chance to pay back the humans for what they've done. Once we take their precious holy city, we'll have already dealt a serious blow to those weaklings. They'll be shaking in their boots! Yeah! <laughs> Listen up, Kevin. We'll be taking Jad, then it's straight to Wendell. You hear that, Princeling? <laughs> Your old man picked me to lead the Beastmen to victory. He trusts me with his invasion plan, not you. How does it feel to be a waste of space, huh? <laughs>
hear something through the wall. I know that voice. Hmm. Well done, Gormand. <laughs> it's an honor to fulfill the wishes of the king. Tell me, were you impressed by my dark magic then? <laughs> Corrupting the will of a tiny pup to attack my son is child's play. No matter. It induced Kevin's transformation as planned. With no more attachments to keep him from training, my son will become a weapon. I have no more need of you. Leave. Wait, what? Uh, be reasonable, your majesty. You called yourself Death Devourer, did you not? Oh, yes indeed, your majesty. <laughs> I leave my son to you. Understood, sire. Wait, 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 I've come to you with an offer. Wouldn't you like to know how to bring your little Carl back to life? Huh? Shh, listen. Ferolian forces are on their way to win as we speak. You need to find the Priest of Light who lives there. Why? Because he knows how to bring back the dead. You lie! Oh, now does this look like the face of a liar? You cannot wait! Lutger's guards have already left. If you dally, they may do away with the priest before you arrive. 
Where's Wendell? Where? <laughs> this way, your highness. <laughs> You must make for Mintus. It's just outside the Dusk Moon Forest. And from there, you can cross the sea to the city of Jad. Wendell is quite close to that location. Hmm? So don't dodge, or Ludger will have complete control of Wendell before you even arrive. Understand? Try to stay out of the sight. Okay? In fact, I shouldn't be seen here with you either. I'll take my leave. Goodbye and good luck, young prince. Carl. Wait for me. Priest of Light and Wendell will tell me how to bring you back. Still my best friend. Carl, that coward is no father. He must be the reason. Mom left me behind. Is she alive? I want to see her. Kevin burned with hatred for his father and shame for the feral blood in his veins that made him deliver the final misguided blow to his only friend. As the Ferolian troops left the castle, the young prince was hot on their heels. He had to get to Wendell and ask the Priest of Light to bring Carl back to life. Fairy, I go with you. My wish is granted. Of course. Come with us, and I'm sure the goddess of mana will find a way to bring Carl back. Once she reawakens. All right. I'm in. Escaped Jad, but been running around blindly ever since. Why don't you ask around town for ideas? Sounds like a good idea to me. I could use some new gear. Let's look in the shops while we're at it. <laughs> 